In this video, we're going to show you to install the O2 sensor on your Nissan Frontier, located in the exhaust, Bank 1, Sensor 2. Now underneath here on the passenger side, you're going to locate the rear O2 sensor. This is the downstream. Use a 22 millimeter wrench. And we want to try and loosen this. Now what we're doing is just going to break this free from the pipe. Before we continue to spin this out, we're going to follow the wire up and it goes to a connector just a few inches up on the side here. Now if you follow the wire up, we have the wiring harness right here. There's a little tab on the back side. Now normally you can pinch that with your thumb and pull the connectors apart, but this has some mileage on it. This is some sand is probably stuck in there. So I'm just using some hose pliers kind of get around and I'm just going to use that to assist in pinching this little lock tab and then pull the other connector out of it. Just like that. Now with this disconnected, we can go ahead and unscrew the O2 sensor from the pipe. Ideally what you want to do is hold that wire and rotate the wire with it. You don't want it to twist on itself. And go ahead and set that aside. And take your sensor. And we're gonna thread that in. As we spin this in, you wanna make sure that you spin the wire harness with it. We don't want that to bind up. Now we're using a 22 millimeter wrench. Go ahead and tighten this down. Now once you feel it start to tighten down, you're gonna feel the crush washer starting to collapse. You wanna make sure that it is fully collapsed and that the O2 sensor is in there nice and tight. connect the O2 sensor harness here. Good, push it together. Make sure you feel it and hear it lock into place. Ours would have had a metal tab up top for you to secure that on and you're all set. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.